Mm. Ooh. Just imagine a nice big man hugging you. Oh my gosh, with this one. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Miss Sharanda. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are all doing well. I'm coming to you guys with another fragrance review and this is gonna be part two of the replica series from Mason Margiela. Um, it's going to be on the fragrance sample that I showed in my previous um, fragrance review video. If you haven't seen it already, please watch part one. I will link it above for you, of course. Today's fragrances we are going that we are going to review today um, is going to be Beach Walk, At the Barbers, and By the Fireplace. So if you want to see this review, please stick around. Right. So the first fragrance that we want to review from the Replica series is Beach Walk. This is the sample that I have, and this is the sample set from Sephora. Prince is labeled as a female fragrance, okay? Mm, I'm gonna spray it. Let me spray it for you guys. Shake it up a bit. Spray it right there. And let it sit. Mm. This is exactly. Whew, it exact it is exactly what it says it is. Beach walk. It's like you're walking on the sand on the beach and the waves are just hitting the sand and you're just flowing with it. And the air is nice and crisp. That's exactly what this reminds me of. I'm going to let you guys know what the notes are. Um, the notes are bergamot, heliotrope, and coconut milk and it's described as a fresh floral scent with a little bit of lemon in the background um, and also musk of course there's gonna be some type of musk in here just to warm up the fragrance but mmm the musk you guys know is always the bottom note <laughs> To me, it's more, um, I don't know, you get, like, it could be fruity, but not so much. That lemon, but the lemon is very light. It's not something that, boom, hits you. It's more like that fresh, oceany smell. Mmm. This is something that you will really enjoy. The first two scents that I reviewed... They were long-lasting fragrances. This one is no different. This Mason Margiela series, the Replica series, it's so concentrated and it's they smell so good. And this is a great fragrance to wear if you're on vacation, if you're in the summertime. You can wear this one all year round though. It's not, it's not too much. It's not overbearing. It's something that you can enjoy all, all year round. But to me, this takes you to a certain place in your mind that I feel like... Yeah, you just wait for that special moment in time to wear this one. But enjoy this one if you pick it up, okay? So the next one we're going to review is... At the Barber's. And it's exactly what it says it is. It reminds you of At the Barber's. Of course, this is a men's fragrance. Let me put this one. Of course, I have the bottles for you, but I just want to show you the sample size. I love men's cologne, like, there is nothing better than a good smelling man. Especially when he just walks past you and you're like, what was that? <laughs> what was that? Oh, okay. That's what that was? Okay. <laughs> so, um, this scent is described as citrus and woodsy. It has basil notes, lavender notes, tonka bean notes. Um, it's fresh. Mmm. Ooh. 
you know I gotta spray it. It's a, it's a mint cologne, but why wouldn't I spray it on myself? Mm. Ooh. Mm. It warms my heart. It just warms my heart. Ladies, or well, whoever, you, you, you want your man to smell like this. It's very fresh. It's a very fresh, clean men's scent. You know, oh my God, it's like that fresh out of the shower, soapy. Fresh, that fresh men's soap. This is what this is giving me. I can't stop smelling it, I'm sorry. And then that woodsy scent, the woodsy note comes at the bottom as it lays on the skin. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Just imagine a nice big man hugging you. Oh my gosh. With this one. And you know how when you go to hug somebody and then you go to, and you can, you slightly just sniff their neck. Oh my gosh. That's what this reminds me of, like that big bear hug and he smells so fresh and so clean and just manly. Oh my goodness. Ooh, this is this is a keeper. Please get this one. I know I was so emotional about this, but I just love when a man smells really, really good. And once again, this one is called At The Barbershop. At The Barbershop, okay? Pick this one up. This is a good one. It has, it's, it also lasts a long time as well. Um, the next scent that we're gonna smell is by the fireplace, which is labeled as a unisex scent. I beg to differ, but let's see. Here's the sample, once again, this is what the same bottle. And even though all of these samples, you know, are this size, all you need is one spray of it. That's all you need, literally, is one spray. Well, two, two would be good if you want it on both sides of your neck. But all you need, literally, is like one or two sprays of each of these fragrances. Mmm. Mmm. Let me see. Let me see this one here. Mm. To me, when I initially smelled this fragrance, when I first got it, and I smelled this one, I was like, that is a man's fragrance. To me, it reminds me of like an older gentleman. It doesn't remind me of a unisex fragrance at all. Yes, it, yes it does. It's, to me, this is for men. This is it's, it's described as unisex, but I don't see a female smelling like this. I just don't. I would see her more smelling, and this one is described as a man's fragrance. Jazz Club, which you guys already know if you watched the first video, I love Jazz Club. Absolutely love Jazz Club. To me, that's more of a unisex fragrance, like a female will wear it. But this one, no. Definitely no. This one reminds me of, and once again, if you didn't hear the name, it's By the Fireplace. By the Fireplace reminds me of a leather, like like leather, like a old school leather, like a, I don't know, it's like a, yeah, that old school leather with some type of warmness and sweetness mixed with like an older man's cologne. This is the only way I can describe this. Let me tell you guys the notes of this one so this one is described as having is warm and spicy um warm and sweet gourmands as clove oil that's that definitely you smell that the clove oil chestnut accord mixed with mm -hmm, the vanilla is this the perfect name by the fireplace this smells like it will be some type of burning sweet I don't know, cedar type wood by the fireplace. I don't, it's saying orange flower. 
no. This is like to me like a if a man or older gentleman was wearing like a holiday set or something like something around the holiday season, Christmas season or something like that. But this is not something, my personal opinion, that a female would wear. If it is going to be a female, it might be an older female because, you know, I don't know. It seems like as you get older, that's just my taste as well right now. You just like stronger scents. But I don't know. This is too strong for a woman. This is what I personally think. To to wear. Yeah. I wouldn't wear I wouldn't wear this myself. But if that's what you enjoy, you enjoy vanilla mixed with that clove um smell, this clove notes, the clo it's that clove oil. Um with that cedar wood smell. Then this is the fragrance for you. Or if you know someone that enjoys that, like an older gentleman that you know enjoys um, fragrances like this, colognes like this, pick this one up. It has that dark amber wood color. And this one lasts a long too. I basically sprayed all of them when I first got them, <laughs> except for the second half of the um, packaging. But um, yeah, this one is by the fireplace. Okay, if you enjoy this review of these free these three samples, please remember to rate, comment, subscribe, share this video. Um, go pick up this collection. The sample collection is the best way for you to sample all of them. They come in um nice size bottles for you to purchase, but I would definitely recommend this first before you actually purchase a scent from um this series. Okay, thank you for watching. Thank you for coming back. Um, thank you for watching my previous videos. Thank you to my new subbies. Hi, guys. Welcome to the family. And come back. Come back for more videos. Remember to rate, comment, subscribe, share this video. Check the description box for any info that I may have for you. And I will talk to you guys later. And of course, it's going to be a part three so stick around for that as always stay blessed and stay safe bye guys